So here's the idea for the next painting. This is just a drawing on the back of an envelope. And it's about the birds and the, the people and the animals that we see on the way down in the morning and live around here. It's going to be called Friends. We start off with the rainbow lorikeets up in the corner, then Mr. and Mrs. Magpie, the kookaburras, uh, Billy the butcher bird, the herons, and taro, uh, the birds with the yellow eyes, the, the blue tongue red lizard, the seagulls, the magpies when they like to, to eat the peanut butter, uh, the stingrays and the fish, the brim that I swim that I um, that I swim with and that uh, I feed in the morning. So, a painting called Friends. Just before I start work, here are some beautiful things in the studio. There's the crayons. There are all the paint, the paint on the uh, on the old tin plates. How oh, beautiful! How oh, beautiful they are! Now you can find fantastic paintings within each one. There's the view out the window. It's winter again. We swam this morning. Very very cold. But beautiful. All right, so there's the start. There's the magpie with those funny kind of crinkly legs. And there's the start of the peanut butter. Well, that didn't last very long. The minute I put the canvas down flat, I realized I didn't really like the drawing of that magpie. And that I have to, I have to draw it faster and then paint it in. So there's the peanut butter jar. And there's the feeling of the magpie, not what, what it looks like. And then magpies, have got long legs, but they're, they're kind of a bit twisted and bent. And they have they have a very brown eye. They're beautiful. So that's much more the feeling. Now let's go up to the top corner for the rainbow lorikeets. So they've got blue heads and uh, orange beaks and red, a kind of ready orange there, there. So I'll probably paint on this as well but they've got green on their wings, more blue, well I have to stop for a while, I can't get a bit more control, but so far so good. So that's where I am so far. It's, uh, I'm very pleased with it. It's, it's got a nice freshness about it. And look, it's a combination of uh, crayons and paint. So here's Camilla's dog. Well, really it's her family dog, the beautiful Taro. Look, I've painted it about four times it can never be, he's much more handsome than that. He's a wonderful boy. Anyway, that's where I'm at the moment. So this is better, the new Taro. Much looser, much, uh, much more the feeling of Taro. Much better.
what a handsome boy he is and how big. These are the pictures of the dogs that are in the National, were in the National Portrait Gallery for an exhibition about artists' pets. That was Sammy, the Cocker Spaniel. That was the famous spot that uh, spent a lot of time with me. That was Indy, the blue cattle dog. And that was the lovely Bex, Bexley, who was... Uh, they're all buried in the garden. Yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll put them in the painting, but in a kind of soft way. So this painting is finally finished. I put the little dogs in last, Sammy, Spot, Indian Bex. You know, they, they look more like people than dogs because they were more like people than dogs. And then, of course, there is the wonderful and handsome Taro, who's with us oh, today. The rainbow orchids, the butcher birds, the yellow eyes, the blue tongue lizard with his blue tongue, the seagulls, Diver Dan drawing his wings, the kookaburra that comes down, and the magpie who loves to eat peanut butter more lorikeets and then down the bottom the stingray the blue swimmer crab and the fish that i feed feed each morning you know my clever daughter has told me there's one thing wrong with this painting and that is i've spelt friends wrong well i didn't i mean i'm an appalling speller sure but I mean, I've been looking at that word for such a long time. Now I have a dilemma, and the dilemma is this. Will I leave it with its juvenile spelling, or will I write the correct spelling underneath, or will I paint over it? Even I know now that there's an I in Friends. There's always an I in Friends, isn't it? There's I and Friends. So I don't know what I'll do. We'll see. So there's the I in Friends.